Hello, I wanted to share something with you that was I thought was really exciting and that was tethering your Sony A9 to your computer. And this is something, well, and avoiding all of Sony's software. So this is something that I, I thought should, that I thought should be possible. And as it turns out, it is. And I was stoked when I figured out how to do it. So you can see here, I've got the camera set up. I'm doing a product shoot here and I've got the cable plugged in. Computer's over there. You can see there is not, that image is not that image, but let's uh, fire it off. And how long does it take? Thanks, Dennis. There we go, just like that. So once more, there's image there, fire it off. And there we go. How's that? Oh, and, oh, maybe, maybe you're not plugged in. So unplug that. Just quickly change a setting. to Wi-Fi wait for it to finish connecting Dennis quiet please okay so them there and there they are completely wireless I'm super stoked all right so what you got to do in the menu um, so one of these, you've got to set up the FTP, T, FTP, FTP function um, in your server setting. And I've already set mine up. Let's go to FTP5. You need to have your destination. So you need to know what your host name is. You need to port 21. Um, I'm not being secure because I'm on my home network. And what I did... Let's go back. So this is my server clerk. That's the computer computer that's over there. And destination settings. So I've got my IP address of the computer on my local network. And directory settings. So I've specified the directory as you need the back the slash incoming, and I've said does not overwrite. And your computer, your FTP username and password. Now, here's a bit where on your computer, free software called where is it? There, Quick FTP. Download it on the App Store. Comes up. Here's your port number, 21, your root path, and you can, ch oh, sorry. Here's your port number, 21, your root path, that's where you want the photos to go. So that slash incoming is this folder here. This folder is slash. So whatever I choose, this folder here is slash. So on the computer, that's the 2020 there. There's incoming and your, your photos will turn up there. When they turn up there, back in Lightroom, you go to uh, auto import. Auto import, you need to enable it. But let's look at the settings. 
and the settings. So your watch folder, you can see here, is the watch folder. Choose the watch folder, and that's my incoming folder. And I'm moving, after it's found them, I'm moving them to another particular folder. And that's there. And here are my develop settings, metadata, keywords, and I'm just choosing minimal. Okay, there is one thing I did forget, and that is when you want to start your tethered or wirelessly tethered connection, you must go to your menu and go to FTP transfer function, and you need to turn your function on, and then it will all work. I'm going to change that back to wired LAN because it's a little bit faster. And there we go. All right, <laughs> next time.